Okay, so this is the first horse that I owned after I had the kids, and um, I'd say Ananda's maybe seven or eight there. She's just learning to ride, and uh, um, this was at a summer camp that uh, we had. Um, it was an adult camp, and um, so we were just practicing uh, jumping. There's the house. There's the house when we, the year after we moved here. Are those of uh, our property? Uh, yeah, but that's not. Well, here's a, here's a good That's picture. later. If the fences are up, it's. Uh, well, there's like the first, first or second or third year, so that's the looking towards the pit, basically. There's any pictures of the actual well, here's, pit. Here's a good shot, looking towards the old barn. When we moved here, almost 30 years ago, the property had been well used. So they had uh, taken the topsoil away and used the area where the new barn is as a gravel pit. So we had a rehabilitation program come and rehabilitate the gravel pit and create hills that were in uh, harmony with the rest of the landscape. The topsoil was very thin, but we've worked at planting trees to hold the soil and grass to uh, try and create more soil. So uh, it, it's been a long process, but uh, we're, we're getting there. The environment means a lot to me because uh, if your environment isn't healthy, then you can't be healthy. When we take care of our surroundings and be good stewards of the land, we can be a positive influence in the world. My name is Cher Sprague and I'm on the uh, Future Oxford uh, Sustainability Committee. Yeah, um, feel the difference a little bit? It's a steering committee composed of uh, 15 people uh, who are residents of Oxford County. I think one of my questions is, how am I going to be able to make a difference in the environmental aspect of, of this plan? Because I did say that I would help, and, and so um, I think that uh, working together with uh, as many people as possible is the best way to go and to, to get the support of the community. Sustainability is the awareness of being able to use uh, resources in a manner that makes it so that they're available for future generations. The way that I try to work towards a sustainable future is I try not to uh, waste and I try to uh, um, improve my environment so that uh, it's comfortable for myself and for uh, the future. I try to improve uh, my uh, personal environment and I try to help other people be able to uh, make a change within the county. I think it's a responsible way to, to behave and to, to look at the world. It's, uh, difficult to uh, use everything up and, and not care about the future, our future generations, like our kids and our grandkids and, and they're not going to have anything left. <laughs> selfish for a long time so 
don't have to be.